all off the shelf components, all things that are available to the consumer, nothing specialized, everything's off the shelf. Solar panels. Solar panels have micro inverters on them. A highly insulated, high performance envelope. Keep the house cool in the summer and keeping it warm in the winter. Water is actually three times more efficient than concrete at holding uh, thermal energy. Tromwall technology, it takes in the heat and then emits the heat out into the house. So on a zero degree day, you can have hot glass emanating into your house. An innovative material called warm board in the floor. It's a radiant uh, heating system in which it also acts as the subfloor for the structure. And it also has tubes of running water in it that actually heat up the floor. The zero escape, which means they'll survive on what their site gives them. But everything in the house that can be recycled or a reusable material or locally sourced software, it gives us the ability to automate uh, window shades, lights, alarm system, and everything is accessible remotely from any sort of internet resource. Grasses are locally um, sort of inspired. A nutrient filtration technique which recycles all the gray water put out by the house and uses it as irrigation back to the plants. A heat pump that uh, uses also the, uh, the exterior air it can give this heat energy over to the warm water tank, but it can also give this energy to the fresh air that's going inside of the building. Old ideas with new technologies. Passive house certified home, which means it uses 90% less electricity uh, for heating and cooling than a standard house. Reclaimed wood, laminated bamboo. Vacuum insulated doors. Tending glass. So during the day, as the sun comes in, it'll self-tent so that you don't have a lot of heat gain inside your house. Hurricane-resistant steel shutters. The roof is made of standing steam metal, which is an extremely great material to be used where we are subject to hurricane weather. The red cladding is it's actually a composite product made out of wood fiber and a phenolic resin. A rain screen system it helps the wall breathe so that it doesn't retain moisture and have mold, rot, and mildew problems in the future. Sage glass windows which self-tint with the use of a little bit of electricity so it helps reduce solar heat gain in the summertime. No VOC type products, no VOC paints, particle board in our cabinets that's no formaldehyde so we're really thinking about indoor air quality as well. Operable louvers. Solar thermal. A solar thermal air to water transfer, a radiant floor heating. Building integrated photovoltaics. Cylindrical solar panels uh, made of a, a thin film material, SIGs, with a cylindrical design. No matter where the sun is, it's always perpendicular to the surface of it. The green roof reflects the correct wavelength of light that the panels need. Below the floor, we have two inches of water to make a multifunctional thermal storage method. In the winter, the sun's energy can shine across the floor and get absorbed into our water below. Siding, heat-treated poplar, inexpensive wood that's easy to work with, it's very soft, and by doing heat-treating process to it, you allow it to become uh, water-resistant and mold-resistant and be able to withstand the elements. Flooring material, reclaimed white and red oak, and old chalkboards. Energy Star appliances cost no more than regular appliances, but they'll save you an incredible amount on your electricity bills. Shutter screens. It keeps the summer sun off the facade, it provides privacy of the house, and it also provides strategic views from the inside of the house out. An iPhone application that lets us control just about all the features of the home. So you can dial up your house and uh, pretty much tell it to get ready for you to come back. A two by eight wall, and we staggered the studs and filled that cavity with continuous insulation. It's a sprayed uh, insulation, so it covers all voids, and that makes our wall perform at an R40 triple pane, low E glazed, argon filled windows, frosty glass in the clear story, which will allow some light to come in, but no thermal gain. Solar can be beautiful. You can integrate it into the roof. It looks almost seamless. The price tag on this is not that much more than your average house. Solar can be beautiful. Solar can be beautiful. Solar can be beautiful. Solar can be beautiful.